Good morning, this is Debbie again. This is my third video for today. Since I haven't uploaded in a long time, I thought I'd go ahead and um, turn out three in a row. My last one was about my brush collection. This one is about cleaning makeup brushes. Now, right now, I'm using Eco Tools Makeup Brush Shampoo, a deep cleanse for your makeup brushes. Always deep cleanse. It's dermatologic tested, hypoallergenic for your parabens, phthalates. And I got this at Big Lots and removes more than 90% of makeup. Um, I thought I'd try it. It's pretty good. It's very gentle. My brushes aren't that expensive anyway. So I just usually um, use um, just some good deep cleaning dishwashing liquid. But I like to try different things. And plus this was there. Plus this sold out really quickly. So it's good to get a brush cleaner if you can. only have one natural bristle brush and that's from um, uh, black opal is goat hair but everything else is synthetic I prefer synthetic anyway because I also use my brushes to apply facial mask my um, flat um, foundation brushes use those to apply facial masks and they rinse out really and clean very easily now this is um, recommended by so many beauty gurus the Sigma um, brush cleansing mat and I love it has um, different the big ones these this is for like face brushes and then it had the small ones more textures that's for um, lip and uh, eye brushes smaller brushes and everything in between is for the rinsing and um, refinishing like to kind of dry them off then I dry my brushes um, Vertically, I um, have a little suction I put on the mirror, on my bathroom mirror, and I um, gather the brushes in a rubber band. And I just hang them upside down, make sure no moisture goes in the ferrule, so they all dry downward, um vertically. So, and then the back has suction. You put in the sink and drizzle the water, and uh, and just you know clean the brushes. And it's for rinsing eyes, rinsing the face brushes, refine eyes, face brushes. And I sort of follow directions, but I kind of use it my own way. Sometimes I use the part for eye brushes, for face brushes, to get them really clean, get them really deep, deep clean. And um, I don't just use a quickie um, wipe um, to clean my brushes and use them again. No, once I use them, they go in the dirty brush pile, like I said before. And then um, I, I clean them when I get the chance, usually on the weekend, clean them all at one time, hang them upside down, and there you go. Now this I find at Burlington, this is like the dupe of the Sigma one. This is the Express Brush Cleaning Mat. And this is the tiny one, the tiny version. It's great for um, traveling. So many, um, Sigma was the first one I think, but so many have little mini brush mats you put on your hands, or just or like a mitt, or you just put, um, Sigma first had the mitt. Then you, um, and then it came out with the mat, and then they have other ones you just have a little ring, like a ring you just put in, or just put in just a few fingers and, and clean your brushes. There's so many now. And again, it's suction, it's great for the sink, but this is for traveling. This is for face, this part is for face, these are for eyes, rinse eyes, rinse face, refine face, refine eyes. This is the face part, this is the eye part so you can look at that really textury get everything nice and clean so this is my suitcase this is great for on the go in the hotel or if I'm traveling so you know get them nice and clean so that's it you know always clean your brushes clean just use them one time especially on the eyes like I said before you know when you don't want any infection clean um, use them once put them in a the dirty brush pile and you can get brushes um Dollar Tree, Big Lots, all the closeout stores like Burlington, Ross, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, whatever. And they have beauty section have some brushes and just, you know, accumulate brushes um, that are, you know, very affordable. You know, um, accumulate them over time like I have, 80 plus brushes. And then um, you have enough to rotate. Some can be dirty and then we get the clean ones and use them. Especially if you make a makeup every day, you work in the office. I no longer work in the office. I'm, I'm in childcare, so I don't need to wear makeup every day. But if you do wear makeup every day, you know, that way you can rotate the brushes and use a clean brush every single day. 
and then by the end of the week you have a pile of dirty brushes go ahead and clean them at one time on these types of mats with some shampoo or dishwashing liquid or hand soap and just you know keep your brushes clean and sanitary that's the best way to do and um, that way you don't have any breakouts any infections any of that i can't stand people don't clean their women don't clean their makeup brushes that is so disgusting from to me oh that's disgusting so definitely do that and i want to thank you again for watching and again you have a good day